All right, guys, we're back with a new video here with my formerly Bracky Pelma, but now the Titlo Cattle. I don't even know how to say it, but T Vagons. As you can see, it's regrowing a leg right here. It molted recently, like about a couple weeks ago. It's kind of like skittish right now. But it's um, also missing a leg on this. This one's had a rough life. I've had it since it was a sling, and it's it's doing good. It's doing way better than it was when I first when it first you know when it had its first couple molts. It's really chill. It's they they're like this species loves to like dig dig like so their for like their mechanism of getting away from like danger is to like dig a hole and just get under like underneath <laughs> underground asap it's funny watching these guys they're pretty neat actually but they're also kickers as you can see I mean, it had a little ball spot in his booty but yeah I, I, when i was trying to get it out it literally was just going through its little tunneling system but it's a cool little guy i'm hoping it, it's a girl but you can see it's a uh, leg that it's regrowing is a little weak. So hopefully it the next time it molts it gets even stronger. Hopefully it doesn't end up kicking that leg that's growing out right now. And having to start over because on the left side it's going to have the same thing. It's next mole is probably going to have a little nub leg like that. And then soon enough it'll have a legitimate leg. You know, eventually it'll grow back to having its leg. But the T Vagons, they like to, they're called the Mexican Red, um, ah, excuse me, Mexican Red Rump. Because their booty, let it focus, see how it's red? With these guys, this is a juvenile, but when they grow up and they become like adults, because they were formerly brachypelmas, I mean, they still get that huge size, like, you know, that beautiful size. And the females, they get this, like, black velvety look, and then they have their bread booty. It's really beautiful. You can see the web kind of, <laughs> it's web kind of going in the wind. But, yeah, hopefully this is a female, like I said, but they grow pretty big. They get up to, like, six inches in, like, girth and, like, also, and like I said, they get like super black velvety, and their booties get red. But yeah, they're super like docile species. One of the beginner species I would recommend getting, as you can see. It doesn't bolt off. It'll, it's a little weird when it walks, because it's like, in a way, deformed because of it's molts it's always had bad molts i don't know why it's last before this molt its back legs were being dragged but now it's not dragging its legs but they're still kind of like he's it's weird his back legs are weird so i'm gonna conclude this video and take this guy back to his home before he gives me a threat posture right here see how he walks this guy's a fighter for sure Hopefully, his legs will get into, you know, the right, right way. They will perform the right way within a couple molts. If not, he would have kicked them out by now. But anyway, thank you guys for watching this video. Like and subscribe.